What's going on y'all? Welcome to the Single Guy channel. My name's Lloyd, not the single guy. Today we're gonna to be talking about a subject, the number one trait that makes you a high value guy, right? If you're a guy who's watching this video, hopefully you wanna be a high value guy because if you're a high value guy, that means you're probably gonna get a high quality woman. <laughs> so if this is you, I highly recommend that you pay attention to this video because this is something that pretty much no matter who you are, if you do this, you're going, if you're not a high quality guy right now, you're going to be one very, very soon, okay? So I'm gonna talk about this and then I'm gonna talk about why it's important and examples of using this in your everyday life because if you're not doing this correctly, you're probably getting ghosted, you're probably getting flaked on, women are probably not respecting you and they probably have no interest in meeting up with you, right? Or maybe it starts out good and then it fades away because they realize you don't have this, okay? And the thing that I'm talking about is how you value your time. This is one of many traits that I think high value guys have, but probably one of the more important ones. An example of what not to do is basically give your time away freely to everybody, like it's worth nothing, right? Sometimes some of you might be thinking, oh no, I don't do that. But then when that special someone comes into your life, you drop everything whenever they wanna meet up, right? Maybe you're too available. I remember when I was doing this, uh, in my early 20s, I remember there was this girl named Julia. Julia's not a real name. Um, she was this girl who was, I was texting a lot. I was texting her every single week for a long time. <laughs> I'm not even gonna say how long, it was, it was a while, all right? And I remember I was so eager to meet up with this person that I would literally drop everything when she texted me or when she was, you know, she said she might hang out with me. I remember literally there, she texted me late at night and she was at a bar and I literally ran to that bar. This is my early, uh, very early 20s <laughs> uh, when I did this. I was such a sim for this girl. And what I began to realize was that this woman doesn't value, I should call her, she was a girl. Like, this, this girl does not value me or my time. And as a result, she doesn't respect me. And if you watch my channel, you know that if no respect is there, she's not gonna sleep with you. Right, So this happened for a long time until I put my foot down and I was like, you know what, I'm not putting up with this anymore. Right, And slowly but surely, it took me time for me to figure out how to value my time and above all, when somebody wasn't valuing it, how did I let them know that I'm a guy who values their time and if they don't wanna do that, then we can't be hanging out. You, you, there's a way to do it without being mean. Um, and a lot of guys think that if you start valuing your time a lot, you price, you, you, you know, your time is super, super valuable. Well, that means you just don't have time for any women and you completely ignore them. That's actually not true. That means your time is worth nothing because you're not giving it to anybody. It, it doesn't work like that. If it was just as easy as ignoring everybody, then I wouldn't have a channel and you guys would have this all figured out. It's a little bit more complicated than that. You have to provide value to people. You have to, it's not that you don't care about women. It's that you have something that you care about more. And hopefully that thing is yourself. You should be caring about you and your health. You should be caring about your career. You should be caring about your family. You should be caring about your close friends and the people who matter to you. And then after that, a woman you're texting or a woman that you're dating. Yeah, and then if she becomes your girlfriend, maybe she can move up into the friends category, number four. And then if she, you marry her, then she becomes part of your family. So then now she's three, but you still come first. You always wanna put yourself first because if you don't, you're not gonna keep improving. You're not gonna keep leveling up. She doesn't wanna be with a guy who's not leveling up. That's not a high quality guy. A high quality guy has potential and improves and gets better over time. He's not complacent. He doesn't stay the same place for too long. You always gotta be moving up because if you don't, she will leave you. She will start, no matter how much you say you love her, no matter how much things you do for her, she will find a reason, a way to get irritated and bothered and break up with you. It always happens. And on top of that, if she sees you're not valuing your time, she won't even go out with you in the first place. Like from my example, you know, getting flaked on all the time, not getting texts back, it's because you don't value your time. They know, it's, they know it's meaning, they know it's not worth anything. But if it is worth a lot, your time is worth a lot, you can bet they're gonna text you back. You can bet they're gonna show up on that date because they feel special, they feel important to be a part of your life. They, they know you don't give your time to everybody. They know your time is valuable, so they feel valuable in return. A man who doesn't value his time cannot be high value. You can't be successful in business either. You can't be successful you know, in life or, or you know, out of sport or whatever it is that you do if you don't know how to value your time. So it starts with a decision. It starts with valuing yourself. 
Okay, say I'm gonna value myself. And you can put a price tag on your time if you want to. I don't care who you are, where you come from. When you're watching this video, you should be at least pricing your time at $75 an hour. You know, 75 bucks an hour is pretty cheap. You can make 75 bucks back anyway, but you can't get that hour back. No matter what you do or how rich you become or how famous you are, you can't get time back. And that's why it's so valuable. And guys who are high value, high quality men understand this concept. It's the most valuable resource that you can give any woman is your time. No matter what you do, no matter how rich you get, it will always be time. All right? So, that's what I have to say about this, you guys. Again, there's this is this is a big one, but there's so many more important qualities out there when it comes to being a high value guy. So if you want to get access to that, come to my masterclass May 14th. Uh, this Saturday at 11 a.m. Central Time, there is a link in the description box below. Just click on it to register. I look forward to seeing all of you guys there. Thanks for watching. Good luck out there, you guys.